Hello and welcome to the new video of Revit SEM where I'm going to show how we are going to do or we are going to calculate the duct area uh, the, the area of duct fittings which is normally not easy or normally not possible with Revit so we are going to do it as per the system because on the single floor plan we have lots of system so we'll just choose one system as we can see here this system is ah 01 supply and we are going to calculate the areas of this this system so but in order to do in order to do that we have introduced a single parameter in all of the duct fitting families it's called the red area which is the redundant area and uh, what we are going to do with this is let me show you that we have when we will use dynamo to calculate all the surface areas of this fitting so it will include all the sides like inlet and two outlets so the red area with will actually calculate the 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 inlet and outlet areas so that will be subtracted later on from the all the surface areas of the this fitting and all the fittings from the it will be subtracted from all the surface area collectively so that we will get the fitting area and now i'll close this <clears throat> so basically we have the that same parameter calculated in all the fittings here we have this asymmetrical elbow with 200 by 200 and 300 by 200 inlet and outlet respectively and we have got this red area and then we have in another area which is the uh, which is the family uh, the project parameter and i can show that here in the manage the project parameters we have got this fitting area which is related to duct fittings so we have got all the red areas of all the fittings here we have got this much red area the red area basically is the calculation which is to be subtracted from the total surface areas calculated by the dynamo so i have the fitting area value of zero as the moment and now i'll go to our dynamo program and here is the dynamo program we we'll start from the duct fittings and here we are just using the system name to filter out the all the fittings of ahu01 supply and by just filtering it by boolean mask we've got all the fittings which are uh, which are the, the uh, 385 total elements the total surfaces and then when we and then when we add them we've got all the some area of all the fittings and then here we've got the parameter red area that is going to be used and the finally we are going to subtract it from the all the surface areas collectively from the dynamo and the red area will be subtracted and just i just need to connect this from this and then click run and boom so we have got all the fitting areas calculated here we've got and then we've got this one here fitting area and then we've got this fitting area hope you will hope you have enjoyed this have a nice time